Alice. I'm a composer, artist, and amatrice de la langue française. Ça fait à peu près deux mois que je suis déménagée à Paris pour étudier. Et ça fait à peu près six semaines que j'étudie sans cesse. Et maintenant, c'est les vacances. Et donc, je me suis faite le cadeau de voyager dans le sud. Je vais passer deux nuits à Cannes-sur-Mer et puis deux nuits à Nice avant de rentrer. Euh, maintenant, actuellement, je me retrouve à la gare de Antibes et euh, ils ont apparemment annulé presque tous les trains vers Cannes-sur-Mer, ce qui est assez frustrant parce que ça doit prendre genre euh, 10 minutes, 13 minutes et euh, bon, ça va toujours prendre 13 minutes, mais il me faut juste attendre 40 minutes pour pouvoir prendre le train. I'll spare you the 40 minutes wait on the platform and I will see you in Cannes-sur-Mer. I'm saying this for the second time because I came in here and put the camera down, but the delight is genuine. This is so sweet. Oh, <laughs> I'm very happy. This will do nicely. Let's look outside. This is adorable. Okay, on est à peu près 15h20. So far, I have no plans for this afternoon. I was thinking about my goals for this holiday. I don't want to have too many. I don't want it to be like a really productive holiday where I just like spend it walking around and going to museums and returning more tired than when I started. And especially in this case, I'm starting very tired. And so my goals are going to be swim in the ocean, sleep a lot, do a lot of yoga, and see Renoir's old house. Anything else on top of that, great. Are any of those things going to happen today? Sleep, yes. The other ones, we'll have to see. Good morning, bonjour. I just witnessed some seagull drama. Hier soir, j'ai dormi pendant 12 heures, c'est-à-dire de 9 heures jusqu'à 9 heures du matin. Donc je me sens infiniment mieux. Et now I'm going to the sea and I'm gonna maybe have a swim. Let's see. sound that the waves make on the rocks. We don't have many um, pebble beaches like this in Australia. Um, and I dare say if I wasn't wearing boots, it would probably hurt quite a lot to walk on here. Um, I wonder what they do in summer when there are more people on the beach. Um, but anyway, I guess I'll find out because I am pretty keen to swim. No one else is swimming, everyone's in jackets, um, but it's on my bucket list for the holidays, so I think I'm gonna do it. so beautiful. The temperature is so beautiful. Fuck, those rocks really hurt your feet. Um, but wow. The 
Okay, everyone knows that the second best thing to do at the beach, apart from having a swim, which is the first, is to go walking on the rocks. So that's what we're gonna do. Et ça tombe bien parce que j'ai vachement froid et j'ai besoin de me réchauffer um, assez vite. Donc on y va. Well, this has been very nice. Not many actual Renoir paintings, maybe like three or four, but still just like such a beautiful place to come, such beautiful vibes to soak up. I learned some things. I learned that um, Renoir's sons were artists as well. They were ceramicists. There was Jean Renoir and Pierre Renoir. And I think Jean was a ceramicist and Pierre was a filmmaker and maybe also like sculptor as well. So yeah, I'm very glad to have walked up this hill. I think I'm going to take a quick visit to the gift shop and then keep going on this evening walk.